In today's gospel, three magnificently dressed kings from the east arrive at a stable which is sheltering a man watching over a beautiful woman holding a child in her lap. Such an image of the epiphany has permeated our consciousness from early childhood by way of the various popular and classical depictions to which we have been exposed. If we are familiar with Giancarlo Menotti's opera, Amal and the Night Visitors, in our mind's ear, we might also hear the kings break into rich three-part harmony as they carefully place their lavish gifts of gold, frankincense, and myrrh at the feet of the child. Artists keep trying to capture some of the glory of this divine manifestation. No matter that the gospel, as you may have noticed, never talks about three kings. Matthew identifies the visitors as magi, that is, wise men from the east, members of a hereditary priestly class from the land of Medes and Persians. The picture breaks through boundaries of geography, religion, and social status. The glory of God shines for all. The poor child Jesus is an infinitely rich and golden gift for people of every nation, race, religion, and for those from the east, west, north, and south. Look around your personal spiritual horizon to reconnect with the star leading you on your journey to God made manifest in Jesus. Decide what next steps you need to take in order to bring the gift of yourself to him.